Hi friends, once again welcome back to my channel Mugambiga Nursing. Friends here we are discussing questions for RRB Nursing Superintendent exam. Also these questions will be helpful for your other nursing officer exam like MHSRB exam. Today we are discussing one previous year questions and answers. Try to collect all the previous year questions and answers. It will be very useful for your exam preparation. First question, the size of endotracheal 2 for intubation of a female patient is options option A 5.5 to 6.5 French, option B 5 to 6 French, option C 7 to 7.5 French, option D 8 to 8.5 French. Here the question is endotracheal tube size for female patient. Okay, it is 7 to 7.5 French, option C is the correct answer. Move on to the next question. Gray hepatization is seen in options. Option A, malaria. Option B, permanent tuberculosis. Option C, cardiac cirrhosis. And option D, pneumonia. A gray hepatization is the feature of pneumonia. Option D is the correct answer. Move on to the next question. When a patient is admitted with chest pain and presents with elevated jugular venous pressure, cardiogenic shock and clear lungs, the nurse should suspect. Options. Option A. Anterior MI. Option B. Inferior MI. Option C. Anterolateral MI. Option D. Right ventricular MI. Here the question is. Patient with the compliance of chest pain. Elevated jugular venous pressure and cardiogenic shock and clear lungs are the features of right ventricular MI. Option D is the correct answer. Move on to the next question. If a patient with heart failure is getting laxis and digoxin, the most important nursing action is to do. First option, keep intake and output chart. Option B, evaluate serum potassium level. Option C, check for heart rate. Option D, check daily weight. Here the question is. A patient with heart failure is taking laxis and digoxin. Our question is the most important nursing action. Okay, all are we are evaluating among this most important nursing action is to evaluate serum potassium level. Also, we will take intake and output chart, heart rate also we will monitor and daily weight also we will do. But the most important thing is we have to check the serum potassium level. So, option B is the correct answer. Move on to the next question. Coeringian's pulse is seen in options. Option A. Mitral regurgitation. Option B. Aortic regurgitation. Option C. Mitral stenosis. Option D. Aortic stenosis. Coeringian's pulse is also known as water hammer pulse or collapsing pulse and which is seen in case of aortic regurgitation. Here answer is option B. Move on to the next question. Drug of choice of paroxysmal supraventricular tachycardia is options. Option A. Amiodarone. Option B. Adenosine. Option C. Atropine. Option D. Cephalexin. Drug of choice of paroxysmal supraventricular tachycardia is option B. Adenosine. Move on to the next question. Question number 8. A drug that precipitate acute kidney injury is. Our options, option A, copidrogal, option B, amoxicillin, option C, diclofenac and option D, cephalaxin. Here our correct answer is option C, diclofenac. Diclofenac is an example of analgesic which can cause kidney injury. Move on to the next question. And the question, soiled dressing material is disposed in. Options, option A, red bucket, option B, yellow bucket, option C, green bucket, option D, black bucket. Here the question is soiled dressing material is disposed in yellow bucket option B is the correct answer soiled dressing materials blood 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 related product all we are dispersing goes cotton all we are disposing in yellow bucket. On to the next question 10th question maximum donor ischemic time in heart transplantation is options option A 2 hours option B 4 hours option C 6 hours option D 8 hours. And the correct answer is, it is 4 hours. Option B is the correct answer. Move on to the next question. 11th question. Strongest direct stimulus to the respiratory center is. Options. Option A. Hypoxia. Option B. Respiratory alkalosis. Option C. Increase in pH. Option D. Rise in partial pressure of carbon dioxide. Here our question is, which is the strongest direct stimulus to respiratory center? It is 
arise in partial pressure of carbon dioxide option D. And the next question, question number 12th, press by gosis means options, option A, loss of taste related to aging, option B, loss of hearing related to aging, option C, loss of position sense related to aging, option D, loss of balance related to aging. Press by gosis means it's a loss of hearing related to aging, option B is the correct answer. Move on to the next question. Unusual occurrence of a disease in a excess of the expected occurrence in a community is called. Options. Option A. Pandemic. Option B. Endemic. Option C. Sporadic. Option D. Epidemic. Unusual occurrence of a disease excess in an expected community is known as epidemic. Option D is the correct answer. Move on to the next question. At the primary health center level, vaccines are stored in options. Option A, Iceland refrigerator. Option B, deep freezer. Option C, cold box. Option D, vaccine carrier. Here our question is, vaccines are stored in primary health center level in Iceland refrigerator. Option A is the correct answer. Move on to the next question. Question number 15. Measles is transmitted through options. Option A. Contaminated water. Option B. Droplet. Option C. Infected blood. Option D. Vectors. Measles is a communicable disease which is transmitted through droplets. Option B is the correct answer. Move on to the next question. Question number 16. India's first 24 hour service for children. Childland operates through a national toll free number. Options. Option A, 1096. Option B, 1097. Option C, 1098. Option D, 1099. National toll-free number for Childland Service is 1098. Option C is the correct answer. Move on to the next question. The focal point of delivery is ICDS service in a community is options. Option A, sub-center. Option B, family welfare center. Option C, kudumbasri unit. Option D, anganwadi. And the correct answer is, it is by Anganwadi. Option D is the correct answer. Move on to the next question. Bagazosis is due to the inhalation of options. Option A, hair dust. Option B, sugar cane dust. Option C, cotton dust. Option D, coal dust. Bagazosis is due to the inhalation of sugar cane dust. Option B is the correct answer. Move on to the next question. 20th question. Chemoprophylaxis belongs to which level of prevention? Options. Option A. Health promotion. Option B. Early diagnosis and treatment. Option C. Specific protection. Option D. Disability limitation. Chemoprophylaxis belongs to specific protection. Option C is the correct answer. Move on to the next question. 21st question. Orthotoledin test is performed to find out. Options. Option A. Iodine in water. Option B. Chlorine in water. Option C. Fluorine in water. Option D. Pathogens in water. Orthotoledin test is performed to find out. Chlorine in water. Option B is the correct answer. Move on to the next question. Question number 22. The most common organisms used as an indicator of fecal contamination of water is? Our options. Option A. Coliform organisms. Option B. Fecal streptococci. Option C. Clostridium perfringens. Option D. Shigella group of organism. The most common organism used as an indicator of fecal contamination of water is? Coliform organism. Option A is the correct answer. Question number 23. Which one of the following is a specific indicator of population health? Options. Option A. Crude death rate. Option B. Expectation of life. Option C. Infant mortality rate. Option D. Proportional mortality rate. Our question is specific indicator of population health is infant mortality rate. Option C is the correct answer. Move on to the next question. Question number 24. In a village population, there are 68% Hindus, 20% Muslims, 15% Christians, 2% Sikhs and the remaining 3% are other religion. The data can be best represented diagrammatically by option A, option A pygram, option C histogram, option B bar diagram, option D normal curve. It can be represented by using pie gram. Option A is the correct answer. Move on to the next question. 
ट्वेंटी फिफ्थ क्वेश्चन ग्राम सफा इन ए विलेज कंसिस्ट ऑफ ऑप्शन ऑप्शन ए ऑल पॉपुलेशन ऑफ द विलेज ऑप्शन बी ऑल अडल्ट मेल पॉपुलेशन ऑफ द विलेज ऑप्शन सी ऑल अडल्ट पॉपुलेशन ऑफ द विलेज ऑप्शन डी ऑल इलेक्टेड मेंबर्स ऑफ द विलेज ग्राम सफा कंसिस्ट ऑफ ऑल अडल्ट पॉपुलेशन ऑफ द विलेज ऑप्शन सी इज द करेक्ट आंसर हियर वी आर डिस्कसिंग प्रीवियस इयर क्वेश्चन एंड इट्स आंसर्स If it is useful for your studies, please share my videos to your friends circle. Only we are discussing questions and particular answer. If you want more explanation, please comment me in comment box.